శ్రీ జైపాల్ రెడ్డి ఆనరబుల్ మినిస్టర్ సైన్స్ అండ్ టెక్నాలజీ అండ్ ఆర్ట్ సైన్స్ డాక్టర్ ఆర్ఏ మసల్కర్ చైర్పర్సన్ నేషనల్ ఇన్నోవేషన్ ఫౌండేషన్ డాక్టర్ అనిల్ గుప్తా ఎగ్జిక్యూటివ్ వైస్ చైర్పర్సన్ నేషనల్ ఇన్నోవేషన్ ఫౌండేషన్ డాక్టర్ టి రామస్వామి సెక్రటరీ డిపార్ట్మెంట్ ఆఫ్ సైన్స్ అండ్ టెక్నాలజీ ఎక్సలెన్సీస్ డిస్టింగ్విస్డ్ అవార్డీస్ లేడీస్ అండ్ జెంటల్మెన్ ఇట్స్ ఇన్ దీ డెఫ్ విలేజ్ ఫార్ మీ టు బి ప్రెజెంట్ ఫ్రమ్ దిస్ హ్యాపీ ఒకేషన్ అండ్ టు పార్టిసిపేట్ ఇన్ ద ప్రోగ్రామ్ ఆఫ్ ది నేషనల్ ఇన్నోవేషన్ ఫౌండేషన్ విచ్ ఈస్ బీయింగ్ సెలబ్రేటెడ్ టు రికగ్నైజ్ ది అచీవ్మెంట్స్ of grassroots innovators at the outset i compliment the national innovation foundation the india story of the social transformation is slowly unfolding in this decade of innovation every sector needs prudent solutions to the persistent problems among the various weak links in the value chain around the grassroots innovations the absence of community fabrication workshops and laboratories is a major gap the effort of the national innovation foundation to provide basic fabrication facilities to grassroots innovators in the form of 27 community workshops in 13 states including one in jammu and kashmir and seven in the northeastern states is laudable conversion of an idea into a prototype is an important stage in any innovation cycle such fabrication support near an innovator's place would reduce his transaction costs considerably and help the transformation of an idea into reality there are many examples of innovations being recognized this year which demonstrate an ability of the grassroots innovators to develop robust frugal and efficient solutions to local problems such as bamboo processing machines and multipurpose herbal processing machines for the fruits and herbs they not only trigger entrepreneurial opportunities for the innovators but also generate sustainable livelihood options for the users various developmental programs should encourage field trials of such innovations to expand livelihood opportunities in the country the academic institutions should pay closer attention to the creative potential of our society and try to add value to these grassroots innovations to enable commercial or social diffusion such partnerships have to play a crucial role in mobilizing the energy of youth and their faculty guides for making india a truly inclusive society this link between the formal and informal science will not only help those grassroots technology to graduate into viable products but also trigger experimental ethics amongst others universities can also establish co-creation labs where young students and innovators work together a small exhibition of various creative ideas from the hinterland will provide a daily spark to the young minds 
and the challenge their inertia i am happy that various labs of the indian council of medical research council of scientific and industrial research and indian council of agricultural research are actually supporting the grassroots innovation movement i call upon the private sector also to take steps in supporting this inclusive innovation movement the knowledge of women is very crucial in making our society inclusive we have to recognize identify and enhance their ability to solve social problems with the support of the formal system the agricultural growth needs to be accelerated to improve the living conditions of vast majority of people dependent on it Ladies and gentlemen, in the 150th year of Swami Vivekananda's birth anniversary, I appeal to the youth to rededicate themselves to make India a creative, collaborative, and compassionate society. There are many problems which have remained unsolved despite the gains in science and technology. Meat transplantation of paddy, picking of tea leaves, the tools of cobblers, the drudgery of manual head loaders. I am happy that NIF has approached attractive awards to those who can offer innovative and extremely affordable solutions for the. purpose i wish innovators all the success in their future endeavors and hope that they will continue striving for reducing drudgery improving efficiency and enhancing the quality of life of the masses without impairing their environment i wish you all success jai hind